Since the outset of the pandemic, Distress Center Halton has taken over 46,000 calls from Halton residents in need of support. We had calls right from the very beginning of the pandemic with people worried about their financial livelihoods as they couldn't do their jobs. That, of course, has led to loss of residence. And we've had so many calls from people truly struggling whether or not they should have food or whether they should keep their house heated. So people are starting to make real sacrifices through this time. And they do call the Distress Centre as a place to talk through their stories, to talk through their anxiousness. Um, we always say you can listen a person's soul into existence. And we are here for everyone, 724, seven days of the week, for people to talk through their anxieties, because it really does help to talk to someone. The pandemic has not been equally divided amongst people, and we know that poverty and homelessness has been hit very hard. And so the United Way has this fundraiser called Sleepless in Our Cities, where it's a fundraiser that's set up and we wanted to participate because Distress Center Halton is a very proudly sponsored agency of the United Way. They're supporting over 125 agencies in Halton region. This is the first time Dara will be participating in the annual fundraiser. She's looking forward to helping support the organization that assists her to support Halton residents. I am going to be sleeping in my car and my chair of the board at the Distress Center is also sleeping in her car as we are raising awareness of the homeless in the greater Halton region for the United Way of Halton and Hamilton. And uh, we're supposed to raise a thousand. And at last check, we were at 3,600 and we're gunning for 4,000. And this is important because this initiative is going to be doubled by a corporate sponsor. So a shout out to June and Ian Cockwell for matching the donations for this incredible fundraiser. With a forecast of minus 11 and possible snow Friday night, Dara says the event is all to raise awareness of the homeless in the region. So I've already thought about it as I'm watching the weather, worried about how cold it is, and ensuring I, I can borrow the right stuff. But what if you can't? And even what if you're on the ground? At least I'll be above ground in my car. So it does make you reflective of what so many people go through that you wouldn't have thought of before as you collect your stuff to get through one night when some people have it 365 nights of the year. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.